and welcome to How to Cook Great Food. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family? Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. On the menu today, and as you can see here, steaming hot straight from the pan, we're making a garlic, chicken and mushroom creamy pasta. Really delicious, does not take long at all. Let's go and do it. Okay, let's take a look at some of the ingredients we're gonna be using today. In the center, I've got my pasta, which is cooked already. I'm using the farfalle, but you can use anything, penne, spaghetti, you just go in the direction you want. Here I've got some chicken breast, no skin and no bone, and I've cut it really kind of nice and thin, so it cooks really quickly. I've got some onion here, I'm using a white onion chopped. On this side at the front, I've got some cream. This is a thick cooking cream. It's a long life cooking cream. We use it a lot in, in the sort of catering trade. Um, you could use a regular single cream. Any type of cream is gonna be fine, actually. At the back there, I've got some fresh mushrooms that I've sliced. In there, plenty of garlic. I want this real kind of garlicky flavor to this. Here I've got some dried basil or basil, but of course you could be using an Italian type dried herb or you know oregano or something like that. And in there I've got some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. We're gonna start this off with a touch of olive oil and of course a bit of salt and pepper. Okay, so I've got my pan here. You're gonna need like a wok or a pan or something. And I'm gonna give this a bit of a spray up with some olive oil. And to that, we're going to add our onions. And our garlic. Now, I've kind of roughly chopped my garlic, but you can, of course, choose to do it a different way if you wanted. While I'm here, I'm going to get some pepper in. I'm going to get in that dried herb. Today I'm using basil. Get a little bit more oil in there as well. Then we're going to add our chicken. So on this just above medium heat, let's throw this around in the pan. For about four minutes, I would say. So this is coming on really nicely. And it's at this stage we're now gonna add in our fresh mushrooms. And again, about another three to four minutes. We might get a bit of moisture from the mushrooms. Keep stirring pretty much all the time. And as you can see, our mushrooms have broken down and reduced in size, and there's a little bit of moisture in there. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt now. If you wanted some green or black olives, would be fantastic in this. Now we're gonna go in with that cream. Like I say, this is a thick cooking cream. But you could be using any type, but like a single would also work really well. And as the heat goes through the cream, as you can see, it melts down. If you wanted maybe a teaspoon now of like a green or a red pesto in there, it could be really good as well. This is really coming on beautifully. Now what we're gonna do is add that grated Parmesan cheese. Get that into the mix, that will melt in, slightly thicken the sauce. So if you were using a single or a very thin type of cream, the Parmesan will actually thicken you up. 
Wonderful. Now we're going to go in with our cooked pasta of choice. And with the heat on, let's throw this around, get a nice layer, get our sauce all over that pasta, let it soak in. I'm going to cook this stirring all the time for about three to four minutes. And then this is done, I'll see you at the table. And there you go, piping hot, straight to the plate. Really simple, really easy and delicious. Hope you enjoy that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and we'll see you soon. Lots of love. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family?